we is back. Y'all, we back, man. Let me show y'all what the progress is. The progress, I gotta drop this motor out, and that's gonna be it. Let me show y'all what I got going on. I got the gas tank out. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, man, let me tell y'all something, man. Y'all see this right here? Look, this right here, let me show y'all where that was located at, man. A lot of YouTubers that doing these spots, they don't show y'all that shit. It's right up here in the wheel, wheel well. Hook right there and right here, man. So y'all got to y'all got to take that out, man. Uh, the other SRT8, the one over there, it's got one, but it's smaller. It's not like that right there, long as that right there. So, yeah. We got the uh, rear end out. So, what I want to do is, uh, shit, I want to damn, I want to damn uh, paint that right there, man, because I don't like how it, how it look like that. I want to paint it, but I am going to pressure wash this thing right here, get it cleaned up. But I done got this motherfucker out. I done got the rear end out. You guys see, I got the whole inside out. Look, all this stuff right here. If you guys need some Hellcat or uh, the lining in the inside of the trunk, I got all of it, man. Yeah, you get all this shit for like 150. That's the side panels for the seat belts. I got the whole bumper right. You know what? Matter of fact, I throw in the bumper $200. You can have all of it. Y'all contact me. Contact me. I'm in Georgia. Uh, so, y'all see what's going on, man. Inside strip, wire harness is out. wire harness is out i'ma uh take this all this door stuff off man i gotta take the gas pedal out i'm gonna take all that off right there swap it out too so uh let's go over to the srt8 let me show y'all what's going on over here i'm getting ready to put the rear end on i might go ahead and do that today i am kind of tired so this is the wire harness from uh, the hellcat i just got it laying in here right now i'm gonna get ready to install it Alright, that's what we got going on right there. See, yes sir, yes sir. Gotta lay it all out. Uh-huh. I was thinking about, you know what, I might put a couple kill mats down just for the hell of it to give it some more deadening in here. And uh, I'm gonna figure these seat belts out too. I'm gonna, I'm, we gotta try to figure them out right there. Cause I if I don't the, the plugs, let me show you what I mean. By the plugs right here where the seat belt is was uh different from the hellcat uh for the ones that the hip okay so you see right here these are from the hellcat and you see how close they is together two right there and you see how far those are it's not gonna fit in there you know what i'm saying so if i can keep these unplugged without it having a signal on the dashboard i probably will because i don't need these locking up but if not, then I had to use the Hellcat seat belts. But I already cut them, so I had to get them replaced. Which ain't no big deal. I just didn't want to spend more money. But it is what it is. I want, When I put this thing in, I don't want to half-ass do it. Some some guys half-ass do it. Just put the shit in there just to get it cranked and running. You know what I'm saying? So I want to do it right. I want to try to do it all right. But uh, this is where we at so far, y'all. Like I said, I'm swap all that out. So y'all stay tuned. We're going to get this thing right. And if y'all need them liners, y'all hit me up, man. Email me or whatever. Cool it out.